three life-changing rules that will raise your vibration permanently. Now, the reason why raising your vibration is important is because you are energy and you're always emitting a certain frequency from your body, a certain vibration from your body, and you wanna be able to raise it as high as possible because if you're able to raise your vibration, it actually changes the things that you attract in your life. You start attracting different people, places and events into your life and because you don't get what you want, you attract who you are, that's why you wanna embody the highest vibrational energy that you possibly can. You've gotta know that your thoughts are vibrational. Your thoughts emit a certain electromagnetic frequency and that is sent out into the universe. What happens is you then start to attract things that are a vibrational match for who you are being. You wanna align yourself internally to what you want externally. Now, as soon as I figured this out, what I started to do is get myself in the highest energetic state that I could get to raise my vibration. Probably the easiest way for most people to start is to actually move your body, right? And exercise. I like to train regularly, three, four times a week, heavy and strong all the time. I was down Bondi Beach this morning and I was there training with a friend of mine, actually has a big company, a big property company. We were there and we were there training and exercising and that's probably the easiest way because that gets rid of a lot of old stagnant energy out of your body and you should be doing that consistently at least three, four times a week is my recommendation. And you could be lifting weights, you could be doing cardio, it doesn't really matter the type, but as long as you do it. The second thing that I've really found is getting this, what is called brain-heart coherence. Now, with your brain, it is always emitting a certain electromagnetic frequency, and so is your heart. But your heart actually sends out more energy further than what your brain does and what your thoughts do. And that's why it's really, really important to get this coherence. Now, most people, whenever you're in a state of stress, or anxiety or some negative emotional uh, pattern, you are actually incoherent. Your brain waves and your heart waves are actually a mismatch and you wanna align them. And the way that you align them is that you actually got to do practices that connect you to your heart. And the reason, the easiest way to do that is probably to listen to some spiritual music and put, place your hand on your heart and just breathe into your heart and feel your heart beating. And most people, it's easy for them to just think of different moments in their life that they're grateful for. So I really recommend you do that. If you th start your day with thinking of what are three things that I'm grateful for, and I'm gonna feel as if I already have what I want. I'm gonna feel as if I already have that goal, already have that health, that body, that relationship, that career goal, whatever it is, that I already have it, and breathe into it. And when you breathe into it, what it does, it actually starts to create this coherence. And now when you're connected to your heart, you're sending out higher vibrational energy. So that's the second thing that I really do recommend. The third thing that really increases uh, your, your vibration, and it will be out there for you, is actually chanting. <laughs> Now you can chant certain mantras and you can get them um, from you know, different types of spiritual music. And if you just sat there and did chanting with uh, breath, you would increase your vibration through the roof. It's extraordinary because the words emit a certain vibration in Sanskrit, that language. So I really recommend that as well. They're probably the three best ways. I, I definitely recommend that you do them at least daily or weekly and get into that. And that will cause you to attract more abundance into your life. A lot of people get stuck because they're focusing what they don't want, what they can't control, what they don't have, constantly beating themselves up. That will lower your vibration more than anything. So get into a state of fullness, I already have what I want, I'm being what I want to attract, and that will create great things in your life. Make sure you click the subscribe, subscribe button, leave a comment for me, and I'd love to hear what you think down below. See you in the next video.